Hello and welcome to this week's Dodcast, the PlayStation 4 National Premier League, and it's Metro Stars Week. Travis Dodd, <laughs> welcome. Dudes, how are you, mate? Yeah, we got one of your teammates here, Bailey Truscott. How are you? Good yourself. Mate, is he in the under 12s? Why is this yeah. kid? Hey, have hey, a look at him. Well, we had to we had to get permission slip from school for <laughs> yeah. today. Signed by, signed by Dad. To no, we're being a bit unkind. <laughs> He's having a terrific uh, season. Now, he playing is. in the midfield at Metro Stars? Yep. Yeah, well, what do you do in the midfield? Defensive, attacking, tell attacking, us about your game. Yeah, attacking more, creating opportunities going forward and helping out the strikers like Trav. Older, older and players. And doing the running for him. That's yeah. right. Yeah, well, I tell you, now, these young ones aren't bad. No, <laughs> no respect, Jesus. no respect. Uh, great win for you guys, though, in the Cup. Yeah, very good, very impressed. And keen to play in the final next Saturday at Highmarsh. Yeah, um, 3-1 win over Croydon. Tell us about it. Yeah, it was a, it was a tough game. Um, for me personally, playing on that artificial turf, yeah. um, it was quite hard on the legs, being an older mm. guy, older mm. player. Um, yeah, it was frustrating because we go 1-0 up and then virtually from kickoff, yeah. Croydon get the ball, play a, a direct pass and, and get in behind us and score to make a 1-0. Right. So, you blokes are still celebrating the goal, obviously. Still yeah, thinking about clearly. it, getting ahead of yourselves. And, yeah, yeah, and, it, was, and right. it was in the balance for, for a majority of the game and then you know, a pretty fortuitous goal that Liam... Wooding scored yeah. um, a deflection, you know, got cleared back into him and and scored, and then you know from there we uh, were able to go on with it. So Tell us, and who scored the last one? Come oh, on. the third one, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah just reliving the, the days. Tell us, he scored the last goal. Tell us about it. Very good header. Was there you it? Go. Very good header. Yeah. Flick over the keeper. Oh, I don't know about a flick. It was inside the six yard box. So right. I'm continuing that record. <laughs> All my goals you don't move out of that six yeah. yard, yeah, yeah. No, that's good. Yeah. yeah. Um, Bailey, tell us a bit about your background. Where did you start your football and, um, and who have you played for? So originally started off um, playing for Gawler in my yeah. juniors, making my way up into Federation, then playing for Para Hills. Yeah. Um, quickly left Para Hills for a year, played with NTC, and then NTC back to Para Hills where I started playing reserves and first team. Okay. And then got picked up by Mickey moving over to Metro this year. Great. Um, now, you were playing against the Adelaide United youth team this week. Now, I take it, you'd know, you're 17 yourself. You'd know yeah. a few of these boys? Yeah, played Some of your mates were playing? Yeah, played with a few of them growing up. Um, was best mates with a couple of them. Yeah. Before they made their way across to United. All right. Um, who, uh, who were your mates with? Give us some names. Uh, so, like, we've got Riley McGree, um, Alec Mowley, Tommy Stokes. Yeah. People like that always yeah. played with growing up in state teams and NTC teams. Okay. Now, are they trying to get you across to Adelaide United as well? No, I can't say anything at the moment. <laughs> what, what do you mean? I'm just, just, just training. I'm just training. That's a yes, isn't it? That's it's a yes. yes. Just I train. can't tell you anything. Well, it's a yes, no. <laughs> just training with them at the moment. Um, the Metro comes first until right. I've worked out, or until Mark Jones works out what he wants to do mm. um, in the off-season with the Youth League. Mm. Yeah, it's, a, it's a great opportunity though, for, for young boys yeah. like Bailey to... Definitely. To be able to get in and, and train a couple of times with the with the team and and see what the next level is going to be for them and yep. take the next step up. So, yep. um, you know, players and clubs are under no illusion that you know young players want to go on and, and strive to be better, and that's certainly the next step for it. Mm. Now, just looking at the ladder, Adelaide City still strong. Campbelltown beat you guys last week. The Keller had a good win over Blue Eagles. Top three or four teams, are they starting to get away or, or yeah. not? Oh, I think, yeah, especially the top two, um, Campbelltown. Top and, three? No, definitely the top two, yeah. <laughs> 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 but Keller, I think, can still be caught. Um, no, look, th you're right. The top three, they are really putting the foot down now and, and getting the results when they matter. They're and then mid-table, it's very tight, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, and then from, really, from yeah. four to six, uh, it's, it's wide open. Um, mm. I mean, even the relegation... Teams in relegation, it's so tight. So, yep. you know, realistically, if a team like South Adelaide can go on a run, you know, three, four games, they could find themselves in the six. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a, it's tough. It's a, it's good for a neutral. Um, not so great if you're one of those teams that are hovering around the bottom of the table. That's no, for sure. For sure. Now, this week you do play the youth team, but a very, very special curtain raiser game. Tell us about it. Yeah. So, because uh, Adelaide, we're playing Adelaide United. They don't have a reserves team. Uh, the clubs put together uh, a past, they're calling it Legends game. Mm -hmm. um, they're using that term very loosely Gee, as well. you do out of Metro Stars, yeah. Legends, eh? Yeah, yeah. Give yeah. us some of those legendary <laughs> names. So we've got uh, a lot of ex-players. Um, uh, Ivan Karlovic. Legend. Jason Spagnolo. Legend. Uh, Michael Peroni. Oh, another legend, yeah. Con Antonio, oh. the Comets assistant coach, yeah. who I hear is going to miss his game. What? At Comets to come and play in this game. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm hearing. Um, Dino Manillo, yep. uh, Daniel Godley, 
I can't remember. Nah, no, all good names. So big day. No, it's, a, it's, a, it's going to be day. a huge, huge yeah. day, and uh, hopefully we get a few people down to watch that. Yeah. And the the older boys, the legends, are taking it quite seriously. Rumor mm. has it they're they're trying to organise a training session before right. the run. <laughs> Some of them have, haven't yeah. kicked the ball for yeah. five or so years. So. Yeah. Yeah. Like me, if you're back. anything to go by, they shouldn't train at all before the game. <laughs> definitely, definitely. Yeah. Hey, Bailey, thanks for coming in, mate. Great Sorry, to meet you. Uh, enjoy the rest of the season. Yep. And good luck moving forward. Look, if it's at Adelaide United, good luck to you. Or otherwise, a great career in the future at Metro Stars. Yeah, definitely. All right, have a great week with the FFSA.